Are you one of those people like me who really enjoys layering your fragrances with luxurious body care products? Well, this video is for you. I have got some body care products to layer with some perfumes that will make you feel and smell like you're in heaven. Hi my lovely people, welcome back to my channel and if you're new here, thank you for checking out my channel and if you are new or have been watching my channel for a very long time but still haven't subscribed, please take a second to subscribe because it really helps me grow my community, in turn helps me bring you better and better content. Don't forget to click that notification bell right next to it so that your subscribing will count. Otherwise, it's as if you never subscribed. And don't forget to follow me on Instagram and TikTok where I am posting some fabulous content. Professionals in the fragrance world, they don't recommend that you layer your fragrances with scented body products. They say that it interferes with the scents, you know, the unique scents themselves. They recommend that you layer your fragrance with something like a fragrance-free oil, like jojoba oil. This has no fragrance whatsoever and it's very nourishing. So that's what they recommend, you know, and I do that too. As you can see, I've gone through more than half this bottle and yes, it does work to use jojoba oil because it's very, very nourishing. And there's a group of performers and other professionals that say, don't layer your fragrance with anything at all because it works the other way. You know, they, they say, they think, it's another school of thought that layering fragrances with other body care products don't make it last. They don't believe that. They think that just over spraying or just spraying your fragrance directly on your you know, skin and clothes, that's what's gonna make it last. This video is about enjoying the experience of actually layering your luxurious scented body products with your beautiful fragrances. Now, if you're careful enough to closely match your fragrance with the body care product, the scented body care product, it can sometimes work really amazing. I have a lot to get through you guys so I'm going to be really really quick. So I'm gonna start with my favorite ah, combination lately that I have been loving. It's this combination here. Unfortunately I ran out of the actual body cream so I ordered a new one and it's on the way but I want to tell you that this combination right here is a match made in heaven. This is Killian Rose Oud and this is almost the exact same rose scent as this right here. This is the L'Occitan Rose Body Wash. This is their Rose Shower Gel. This, you guys, smells so close it's uncanny it smells so similar to the rose scent that's in here and it's not like slap you in the face kind of rose scent it's like a very gorgeous almost exotic rose scent that is in this you guys know the notes of i'm not going to get into notes of this fragrance i've talked to you like tell your ears blade about this one. It's that gorgeous rose oud, but not too rosy, not too oody. Has leather and cypress oil that makes it super sultry and sexy. That's this one. These two are a match made in heaven. I'm telling you guys, you have to try this combination. Now I'm missing the body cream. So L'Occitane also has a rose body lotion that smells just like the body wash. I will put a picture of it up here. I just ran out of it. I ordered a new one. It's on its way. And of course, I layer the L'Occitane rose 
body wash and the body cream or lotion with my other rose scents like this. This one is the uh, Royal um, Crown Alchemia, which is a gorgeous rose fragrance. It's got, I believe, Taif rose in it, I want to say. And this one is Elizabethan Rose by Penhaligans. Now, if you want an affordable option to layer with your rose fragrances, this right here by the Bath & Body Works, the Rose British Rose Body Yogurt. This one is, you know, it's it's got a nice rose it's rosy scent but it i gotta tell you it's not like the luxaton rose body lotion i mean that's like really good rose scent you guys are very sexy this one is good it's all right i would say it's kind of all right it's not as nourishing like the bath and body works products are not as nourishing to the skin and you know the quality is not as good as Luxaton, of course. I'm just giving you an affordable option. I don't, I bought these, but I don't really use them that often. I find that I don't really reach for them as much, but this is a fairly good option. British Rose Body Yogurt is a, you know, decent rose body product that you can layer with. And actually, I gotta tell you, the yogurt is better than the the body cream although this one is th thicker and more emollient the scent of the body cream is not as good as the scent of the body yogurt so that's another tip so this is also the british rose body cream and this is british rose body yogurt if you want an affordable rose shower gel then you get go for the bath and body works rose shower gel yeah, this one doesn't have that very natural smelling rose or the sexy sultry rose note, but this is a fairly decent body wash. It's, and of course, you guys, from, the, from Lush, I have this rose jam. This is Bubble Bath from Lush. Really beautiful rose scent. I like to take a bath. It has a little bit of glitter, which I don't care for, but... It's beautiful. Um, I like to take a bath with that if I am like, I can plan ahead to wear my rose fragrance, you know. So here is the Luxaton Cherry Blossom Body Cream. You guys, this is so, so beautiful. It's so nourishing. Like that's the thing about buying body care products from a high quality luxury brand, you guys, because you know that the, the price you pay, I know they're a little more expensive. Bath and Body Works or Body Shop or anything like that, but the quality is there, you guys. Oh my gosh, this is so nourishing. It like really moisturizes and nourishes your skin and it has that gorgeous cherry blossom scent that goes with fragrances like this one right here tom ford electric cherry these two are like a match made in heaven especially since the electric cherry has a lighter almost like a lighter kind of i don't want to say sour it's like a lighter cherry that's not a dark cherry it's a lighter cherry almost like has a hint of cherry blossom kind of vibes with that fruitiness Ooh, these together is so good and of course the body wash is also from L'Occitane this is the cherry blossom bath and shower gel you can use these by the way the L'Occitane um, shower gels you can use them in baths you can do a bath with it or you can shower with it that's like the beauty of it and by the way did I tell you guys these bags right here these are the refill bags and they are a better value for your money than buying the little bottles and you know I usually buy the one of the little bottles and then I just buy the refills and I just keep refilling it a beautiful combination the cherry blossom lotion and the body wash with fragrances like of course electric cherry and then this one uh, cherry punk which is like gorgeous edgy cherry leather fragrance and then of course tom ford lost cherry and then this one guerla the uh cherry oud i love the cherry in here that boozy cherry i love that about this but like there's a sharp wood note in here which this really helps kind of soften you know like the body product so now this is one of those instances where you can actually use your body care products to make something that's too sharp softer so in this case you kind of do want your body care products to interfere a little bit with the fragrance and of course if you want an affordable option for the cherry fragrances 
that you don't want to spend the money on the cherry blossom body wash and the body cream from Laxton. These are good. Actually, this smells really good. This is the Japanese cherry blossom from Bath and Body Works. This is the body cream and then this is the body wash. So it's same Japanese cherry blossom. It smells really good, you guys. I got to tell you, it does smell really good and it does smell like cherry blossom. But the florals in here it, it are a little bit um, like the other florals in here, a little stronger. Whereas the Luxaton and that cherry blossom, you can really smell that. You can smell the cherry blossom in here too. Again, a more affordable version, like option for you if you don't want to spend the money on the Luxaton products. All right, so then I have my coconut products, one of my favorite categories for body care products, and of course fragrances too. I mean, who doesn't like coconut, right? My fragrance is like this one. This is the Estee Lauder Bronze Goddess. Oh, I forgot to bring my uh, Coco Vanille by Mansara. That's another coconut product. I just want to give you like an example of what the coconut fragrances are. This bronze goddess actually comes with this bronze goddess shimmering body oil. The name has now rubbed off, but you know, I like this combination too because it's an oil. It's actually really good. It makes the fragrance last long. This is a great combination. There is also a bronze goddess body cream that actually is from Estee Lauder the body cream of the bronze goddess yeah this this doesn't smell like coconut at all um it it's a nice body cream but it's not really like that scented at all so I bought this thinking it was the same scent I'm just like showing you what came with the fragrance it doesn't come with it what was made to go with the fragrance now what I really recommend to you are these two products right here I mean these are amazing you guys and I have one other here too I'll talk about in a second so this is the Sol de Janeiro Coco Cabana cream this is very coconutty Sol de Janeiro is an amazing amazing brand for body care products oh this smells so good like fresh coconut freshly scraped coconut if you've ever scraped coconut it's like this is amazing. It smells so good and it's lightweight. This is more lightweight compared to some of their other body butters. Um, it tends to be a little bit more emollient. And another thing I really recommend that you layer your coconut fragrances with, and this is really in keeping with what the experts recommend too, this is coconut oil. What could smell more like coconut than actual coconut oil? And this is not going to interfere with your coconut fragrance at all. Coconut doesn't have a very strong scent, so it's really highly recommended. I got to tell you guys, my favorite coconut oil brand is Kopari. I'm not going to open this bottle uh, jar because, you know, I have one open upstairs already. Trust me when I tell you this is the most like nice, clean, organic coconut oil ever. Now, Kopari is a little bit more pricey than I, I'd like so I will also recommend you a more affordable option here this is the Shea Moisture 100% extra virgin coconut oil this is like you can get this at Walmart Target whatever have you and this is also yeah this is nice it's like not a strong smack you in the face kind of coconut scent it's the natural actual coconut oil scent there's, it's not scented, like these two are not scented. It's the, the coconut smell is from the actual coconut, but it's very faint, right? So this is very, coconut oil is so nourishing for your bra, uh, body, you guys. I mean, seriously, coconut oil is one of the best things you can rub on your body. Now, this Coco Cabana moisturizing shower gel from Sol de Janeiro is the best shower gel to go with coconut fragrances um, now this is the matching of course the matching shower gel to this Sol de Janeiro coconut uh, coco cabana body cream lotion there um, and this is the shower gel and it smells amazing just like the they both smell the same very coconutty the natural coconutty scent so good now if you want another option that's not Sol de Janeiro I have another one here, a coconut shower gel. This is from Philosophy. This is the coconut frosting shower gel. And this has a nice coconut scent too, but it's a little bit more, again, artificial smelling than the Sol de Janeiro Coco Cabana shower gels. But here's another one for you. 
And of course, in terms of a body scrub that's coconut, this is a natural 100% virgin coconut oil body scrub. Again, it's not scented. It's the natural coconut smell that's in here. This is by Shea Moisture. Did, did I tell you that? Yeah, this is really, really good. It's a nice, I believe it's a sugar scrub, yeah, with that beautiful 100% natural. And this, you guys, when you scrub your body with it, of course, it leaves that beautiful coconut oil on your skin. You actually don't have to put your apply your coconut oil because this has coconut oil in it. Now here's a really good, fairly decent, affordable option for coconut body wash. This is Dove Coconut and Cacao Butter Butters. I think it's cacao butter. So coconut with cacao butter, it's very nourishing. So this is actually not bad at all. It's quite decent, it has a nice coconut scent. A little bit artificial smelling not like the coco cabana one not as luxurious not now as I have a really fun category that has a new exciting product that I just got my hands on oh my god it's like amazing it's a match made in heaven with a couple of my fragrance my vanillas especially but most all of my vanillas I love layering this with I am in love with it. I only like use what was on the lid, so I haven't even put a dent into the actual cream, but there was a lot on the lid already. This fragrance is new and this body cream is new. Okay, I'm talking about Emiklaf Note Vene and the Note Vene Nectar, which is like Note Vene times 10. That creaminess, that, I don't know, vanilla, sweetness, the creaminess, the booziness is 10 times as much in the Note Vene Nectar version, which is the more entense, like intense version of Note Vene, the original, but the original is gorgeous too. It's, they're amazing. But anyway, I'm talking about this Fenty Skin by Fenty Beauty, the new vanilla body cream that Fenty Beauty came out with. Oh my gosh. Oh, you guys, this smells amazing, and you know I love the Fenty Butter Drop because it's so emollient. This stuff is like, it's like a whipped oil, so it's really nourishing and very hydrating and leaves a beautiful sort of supple glow. I love layering this with all of my vanilla scents, but especially these two. Oh my God, it's like a match made in heaven now if you don't want to spend the money on the Fenty skin one which I think slightly expensive more expensive not slightly somewhat I have two other options here too from the body shop and Bath and Body Works this is from body shop this is the body shop warm vanilla this is actually really really good too you guys yeah it's a nice very beautiful vanilla scent but there's some other scents in there too that's not very true vanilla like smell whereas the Fenty skin one that's vanilla vanilla okay so this is a good option for you by the body shop and then you have another even more affordable option from Bath and Body Works this is the warm vanilla sugar ah this is beautiful too this is a nice vanilla -y body cream that you can use and here's another scent category that I love almond scents almond scents like Killian rolling in love oh this one's so good this is that milky almondy Killian fragrance very almondy then you have the girl of now the original very kind of almond pistachio but mainly almond you can smell the almond so I love to layer my almond scents with these products so this one is the almond shower oil you guys know I rave about this I have the bottle upstairs in my shower and this is the refill and I just pour it as it runs out because these are more economical I buy a ton of these whenever Luxton has that 20% off sale I stock up even that even when it's not on sale I buy it because it's so worth it so this it has like it's like it lathers up like body wash but there's almond oil in it you guys so good so this is like almond bubble bath milky bath it's a very milky almondy bath product that you can put in your bath so good you can take a bath with this scrub with almonds scrub here I will talk about or you can shower and scrub your body with the almond you know scrub that I'm about to talk about and here it is this one is the uh, pate de lis uh, delicious paste this is the almond 
paste type of body scrub. It's made from like, I think almond, uh, ground almonds too in here. Uh, this is so good by Luxaton. This is, by the way, Luxaton products, all of these that I just talked about. And then this is also the Amande Body Balm. So this is from Luxaton, the Amande Body Balm. That's the Amande, by the way, those are Amande Shower Gel and Amande Bubble Bath. I love, love, love. These are so nourishing, these Luxaton products, you guys. I can't tell you enough. Luxaton, you want to sponsor me because I'm really really in love with your products oh my gosh if you want affordable options i don't have a shower product that's affordable for almond but i do have the almond milk body yogurt from bath and body works i'm sure they have a shower gel too i just haven't found it and this one again the the problem with more affordable versions or options i'm giving you they're not the best quality, not the highest quality for your skin. In, in they, These are nourishing enough, but not like that kind of nourishing, you know. And also the scent tends to be a little bit more interfering with the fragrance than the scents in those more higher quality products. Now this, you know, is great, but then again, there's something else that's a, a almond scent is there, but there are other scents in here. You know what I mean? So yeah, this is a body yogurt. It's very lightweight. It's a really good option. I'm I'm not knocking this. This is these are really good options. The more affordable options here, really good too. Speaking of almondy products, um, I have another actually one here. This should go kind of with the almond ones, but this stands alone because this smell is very particular and distinct. So I want to mention this separate from the almond ones. This does have almond in it too. But of course I'm talking about the Zerjaf Italica. This is the most masterful gourmet ever made. Super sweet, delicious almond sugar cookie dipped in milk kind of smelling fragrance. This has lactonic notes. This has almond. Delicious. And guess what smells exactly like this? These products right here, baby. These ones right here. You guys know, so this is the Bum Bum, the Brazilian Bum Bum Cream, not Bum Bum, Bum Bum Cream. This is the big daddy size of it. This is the regular size of it. You guys know what this smells like. It smells absolutely heavenly. And it smells very similar to Zerjoff Italica and goes so well with it. And then of course the matching body wash. This is very moisturizing. This is the Brazilian Foreplay Moisturizing Shower Cream Gel. Absolutely gorgeous. And it comes also in a scrub, which is delicious. The scrub is so delicious. This is the, I want to eat this scrub every time I scrub myself with it. This gets the job done so well. Scrub the body so well. Polishes the body until it shines, you guys. So delicious. I love this combination right here with the Surge of Italica with the Boom Boom body stuff. Now I have another awesome note, chocolate. I love to wear my, layer my chocolate fragrances like this one. <sighs> Lilac Amouage, Lilac Love. Mm, so good, you guys. Such a beautiful, powdery, delicate, feminine, chocolatey fragrance. And this one, Cacao Porcelana. Oh my gosh. Oh, this is that boozy chocolate fragrance. It's kind of like white, Swiss white chocolate, only sexy version of it. Oh, it's so beautiful. There's some booziness about this fragrance. So these two, I love to layer with this very affordable, yet very effective and very good for you body cream, actually. Now, here's an example of something I 100% recommend, even though, you know, the price is actually very affordable, too. I mean, that's a win-win, isn't it? When you get a really good quality product for the price, that's affordable, that's right here. So Vaseline, you know, I'm sure this is also petroleum uh, based. You know, Vaseline really locks in moisture of your skin so nothing escapes. And this would probably keep your fragrance from seeping into your pores and disappearing. So because this has Vaseline, this is very effective. I'm very sure of it. This, I actually, my open jar is upstairs, but I didn't, 
this smells very much like I don't want to open a new jar the the one I have up upstairs is kind of gross I've, I've smeared it all over so yeah this is a, a Vaseline that's the the chocolate version it's like the 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 cocoa radiant they call it cacao smelling Vaseline body butter very thick very emollient very good and it layers with chocolate fragrances like a dream okay i gotta thank my good friend here on youtube francis for that thank you darlings by the way i don't have a shower gel that's chocolatey i don't think that exists but if you guys know of a body wash with some chocolate in it just chime down below let me know okay i would be all over that this is i've talked about this one before this is not new this is the sol de janeiro beige floor elastic cream you guys this smells exactly like baccarat rouge 540 okay very close to the scent profile i'm pretty sure they they kind of modeled it after or, or like made the cream to go with the fragrance especially oh i don't want it to go away so i'm gonna put some on this is very emollient squalene this has squalene in it so it's really good for your skin too um even for your body skin on your body so i wear i love to layer that with baccarat rouge um, Maison francis Crejean baccarat rouge 540 and the extrait version of it both of them and i also like to layer it with this one bond number no. nine greenwich village although it doesn't smell exactly like baccarat rouge 540 there are some notes that are similar in these fragrances this smells more like more floral and different kind of way but it still goes really well with the elastic cream the this one's also really good this has like water lily but has share some notes like is it saffron and ambergris or something that uh, that uh, Baccarat Rouge has? So there's a little bit of similarity there. The, the body products that I love to wear with my fruity fragrances. My fruity fragrances like these ones right here. These are super fruity. And these are mainly summer fragrances. This one from M. Mikulov, their latest release, Sole Passion. Such a juicy, beautiful tart juicy burst of fruitiness this fragrance this has like wild strawberries and uh pomegranate and stuff so good oh so good i can't wait to wear this in the summertime you guys and then i have the forbidden games by killian and um playing with the devil these are all fruity fragrances actually no what i have here is liaison dangerous and forbidden games i also have playing with the devil upstairs which is also a fruity fragrance I love to layer my fruity fragrances like this with these products right here, you guys. So this is the Sol de Janeiro Bomb Dia Bright Body Wash. This is new. They didn't used to have a body wash that went with the body cream. They released the body cream first, the body butter, I should say. So here's the body butter, Bomb Dia Bright Body Butter. Oh my gosh, this smells so good too. Um, very fruity. Oh, such a beautiful fruity smelling kind of body products. Um, this has fruit AHAs and BHAs in it. Again, it's good for your skin. That's what I love about this type of uh, more high-end brands like Sol de Janeiro and L'Occitane because they put a lot of really good for your skin ingredients in their products. This is the actual matching body scrub, which I love to layer too. So I like to shower with this and scrub my body with the body scrub and then, you know, use the cream and then layer my fragrances on top. Oh my gosh, it smells so good. And this is a really good body scrub, you guys. Really, really, really good body scrub. I really love it. It's another sugar scrub. Same scent. Absolutely delicious. Does, the, does a really good job scrubbing, actually scrubbing your body. Speaking of fruity fragrances and layering them with fruity body products, I have particular fruity notes that I like to, body products with particular fruity notes that I like to layer with some of my fragrances. Here is a good example right here. So I love this. This is Christian Louboutin, Luby Do. This is a very strawberry scent. The strawberry and rose. There's rose and strawberry, but the strawberry note is very prominent in here. Valentino, Valentina Pink. This has got also a big strawberry note. And then of course, Rouge Trafalgar is another beautiful strawberry, raspberry smelling scent that goes with those um, body products. Now here's where things get a little bit more 
like low-end products because brands like L'Occitane and um, Sol de Janeiro, they make those more prominent bigger notes like coconut, vanilla, like the bigger, more prominent notes that most people use. Specialty type of scents like strawberry, raspberry, you know, pineapple. They, those, those high-end brands don't make body products with that sort of particular scent. So if you want to get very specific like that, you have to kind of go on the lower end products. With them, I have two right here. This is actually raspberry, but it's very kind of close to strawberry smell. This is by Philosophy. This is raspberry sorbet. This one is actually really like artificial smelling. I I don't love it, love it, but it don't, it's, what do you do? That's all there is for <laughs> raspberry. It's not that natural smelling either like that close to natural raspberry strawberry smell either so i'm not sure how much i recommend this one but that's all i have for raspberry and then i also have strawberry right here it's called strawberry soda by bath and body works now this one smells like strawberries again artificial strawberries which is what you get most of the time so here's another very affordable option, strawberry body yogurt, and this one is the strawberry body cream. So I have both, I prefer the yogurt over the, over the cream because the yogurt has a better scent. That's something I noticed in the body shop, it's kind of weird. The creams don't have as good of a true scent as the yogurts, which is odd. Oh, then you have the mango scents and body products. There again, I can't find the high-end stuff, the more high quality, super high quality, uber high quality ones, but these are pretty nice. It's from Body Shop, which is a nice brand. So my mango scents like mango skin here, very fruity, very mango-y um, kind of scent. I believe this even has, ooh, like it's kind of a strong kind of sultry fragrance. So for that I have, this is actually really like this one. This one's very mango smelling, uh, very kind of natural, almost, no, not natural, but you know, mango smelling product. I like to use this mango from the, the Body Shop Mango Shower Gel with my mango scents. And then they also have the Mango Body Butter right here. Um, this is, you know, the Mango Body Butter. I have another one open upstairs. So you also have this Mango Body Scrub right here, you guys, by uh, the Body Shop. You know, it's, it's good. It's a nice mango smelling body scrub. It's not the best grains I, I would like it to be more gritty but uh, it gets the job done and then i have these mango body yogurt and body cream by the body shop the yogurt again has more of a scent than the actual body cream and then one thing i really love to use with my mango scents the body products are right here this is uh, by the brand molly this is from Hawaii, and this is the uh, Molly Mango Body Body Scrub. This is a mango sugar scrub with mango scent, very good. And this right here is what excites me the most. This is the Mango Body Gloss. You guys, this body gloss, it's like, when you put it on, it your body shines like glass, okay? It's a gloss it is, it's so good, and it really layers well with fragrances and make them last long. And then we have also the Mango Nectar Body Cream, which is all right. Pineapple, I have my pineapple scents right here. This is Dolce & Gabbana Pineapple. This is hard to get a hold of. I paid a pretty penny to get this. I don't think you can find this anymore, but you know, you get the idea, like this is a really beautiful summertime pineapple scent. And then we have Lamar by Kajal here, which is dominantly a pineapple note in here that's really delicious. Best pineapple body wash I found. Again, those high-end brands don't make these special specialty scents. Um, I got it from this one right here, Coconut Pineapple by um, Bath & Body Works. This actually smells a lot like pineapple. Yeah, less coconut, it's mainly pineapple. It's a very strongly pineapple. It's really, really good, actually, this one. Now, the Pink Pineapple Sunrise is also from Bath & Body Works. This one is not as pineapple-y as this one right here. This one's very pineapple-y. Coconut, you can't even smell in here. It's, and then I have the body scrub here. This is Pina Colada. Pina Colada smells a lot like pineapple, mainly. So this is 
the body scrub I like to, to layer with my pineapple fragrance. Only pineapple body butter I recommend is this one by Hemp. This is the Sweet Pineapple and Honey Melon. This smells mainly like pineapple with a hint of, you know, like fruitiness in it, like melon, but you can't really smell the melon. And then we have another fruity scent here, which is Passion Fruit, which I also love. So I have the Passion Trio from the Body Shop again. So you have the um, Refreshing Passion Fruit Body Wash from, you know, Body Shop. Very passion fruity. Very good. I actually really like the scent. And then we have the Passion Fruit Body Yogurt here from the Body Shop. Really nice. The body wash smells more like passion fruit than the body yogurt actually. And this is the Passion Fruit Body scrub this one is kind of a gel like scrub you guys like it's not as grainy as i would like it to be like not gritty enough like to polish the body but it it's all right it it's you know it's it's more of a lathery kind of i don't know bubbly one <laughs> it works i like it there's no other option for passion for that particular scent other than those now what i like to layer those with are my passion fruit fragrances. The Hub by Kajal, which is a gorgeous passion fruit scent. Oh, so good. And then I have here Tiziana Terenzi Cassiopeia has a very prominent, mm, gorgeous passion fruit scent. So that's what I like to layer them with. I also, what's that other one? Rasasi fragrance. That's a passion fruit one too. That's upstairs. I didn't bring all of it down you guys. I have a several. I only grabbed one bubblegum scent that I have. I grabbed my Maschino um, toy too. This is the very bubblegummy scent. It smells straight, straight up like bubblegum you guys. The scent. What it goes with, I just, I'm using this already. It was in my bath, so I grabbed it. This comes as a big disc, like it's like this big. This is a bubble bath bar. This is the bubble gum one. It comes in this big cake about this big. I only have a piece left now. So I like to take baths with that. Again, you don't get the high-end products in these type of very specific scents. So I had to go with the the Bath and Body Works version. This is the Bubble Yum Pop. This smells exactly like bubble gum. Okay, so these are like, this smells artificial because it's bubble gum. And this kind of smells like an artificial, not artificial, you know, uh, like a synthetic. Bubble gum is a synthetic note. So, you know, they go really well together. Then I have lavender scents like this one, Lavanda Canon by Lancome, the Meston Lancome line. This is a very lactonic lavender fragrance. It smells like a warm cup of milk with lavender in it. You guys, it smells so good. Oh, so relaxing, cozy type of fragrance. And then we have, of course, the YSL Libre. I only have the Le Parfum here. I also have the, the Entense up there. You get the idea. And then here's another lavender fragrance, Manguerla. On tons, I also have the original, which is more lavendery. So my lavender fragrances, I like to layer with my. I only have the small size. I ran up out of the big size. I need to order a new bottle. This is the lavender body lotion by Luxatan. You guys, this smells just like lavender and very nourishing. I oh, whew, so good, so good. These last forever, by the way these bottles in this small size I've had for a while I haven't had to buy the big size and then for body wash I love to use the lavender bubble bath slash body wash from Luxaton. just ran out of it I need to order more I put the picture up here that's what I highly recommend highly 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 recommend but if you want like a more affordable version of the body wash I have here by Dove the lavender body wash by Dove, which is also good, but not as good as, of course, Luxaton. Also from Lush, I have these two amazing lavender bubble bath bars. This one is called the Cloud, and this is called Calm. This one you hold to the faucet where the water, you know, that you when you're filling your bathtub, and it bubbles up, and this one you crumble and put it in the bath so calming and so relaxing lavender bubble bath I like and then i have here my toffee fragrances so this is man parfum cristal by Mikolaf. you guys know this is that beautiful gorgeous toffee and rose scent that's mainly tro that 
caramelliness from the toffee is amazing in here. This is a gorgeous gourmet uh, by Fujia. This is Amalia gourmet, also has a toffee scent. This has jasmine and toffee. The toffee is delicious in here. So these kind of toffee kind of scents, I like to use this one right here. They just released this, you guys, at Lush. This is a new scent. I just bought it. I've only used it like a couple of times. Oh, this smells so good. This is a toffee scent with florals in it, just like these scents. They have toffee and florals. Ah, oh, this is so good. This is, by the way, Love Shower Gel by Lush. Now, with the toffee scents, I don't have a toffee body butter. What I use usually is the my jojoba oil. I use my jojoba oil for like a body emollient. Then I have my honey fragrances, you guys, like um, Lancome, Maison Lancome line, Oud Ambrosi, and this one, Royal Crown Ambrosia. These are honey fragrances. Ooh, they're very beautiful, syrupy honey fragrances. This one is a little oody too. I like to layer them with this beautiful, beautiful, ooh, this is a soy honey whipped body butter, you guys. This is the most moisturizing body butter ever. It's a bucket of water on your skin. It really keeps the, the whole body so nourished until morning. And for citrus fragrances that I have in my collection, like this one right here, Orange Bigarat by the, again, Lancome, Maison Lancome line. Very citrusy fragrance. I love to layer that with, I like to shower with the Verbena. Body Wash by Luxeton. This is very citrusy. And then there is this one right here, the um, Vervine Mandarin Body Butter um, by Luxeton also. Oh, this is very citrusy, um, beautiful kind of almost orangey smelling citrusy scent. So that's what I like to layer my like citrus scents like this one. I have a lot of citrus scents. I didn't bring all of them down here. Then I have my jasmine like fragrances like this one. White floral scents with a dominant jasmine note that I love to layer with. Sorry, this is in a bag because I broke it. This is the uh, Body Shop Winter Jasmine. I'm sorry I had to put it in a baggie. It just broke. I dropped it and it broke. But I also like to sometimes use this right here and the body butter, the matching body butter with all my jasmine scents. This is uh, Dior Jasma Ange body shower gel and the this one is just my young body butter this is so emollient and so nourishing so amazing they go with this just my young gorgeous scent that i absolutely adore and then when it comes to powdery white florals narciso Poudre by Narciso Rodriguez. I like to use this one right here. This is the ultra rich, you know, body wash by Luxeton. This is, you know, like this has got loads of white floral notes. I can smell them. So they, this is really good with it. Then I have my cinnamon scents and I have this one, for example, Zerjoff Bouquet Ideal. This one is a spicy vanilla. It's, you know, I could technically wear my layer with my vanilla stuff too, but there's something really beautiful, like a cinnamon a note in here that I don't want to overpower with a vanilla body, you know, creams. So I tend to like to wear this with my cinnamon body cream. So the one that smells a lot like cinnamon to me anyway, is this one right here, this, the Fenty, forget the name for this, but this is like a limited edition one she released. Ah, oh, this smells like cinnamon, you guys. Yeah, cinnamon and something else edible. I don't know. So I like to layer fragrances with a prominent cinnamon note with that body cream. And then I have my gardenia scents like Emic Love Gardenia, which is such a gorgeous gardenia scent, you guys. Oh my goodness. And then I like to layer it with this one right here. This is Body Shop, also English Gardenia. This is the only gardenia body cream I have. Um, it's not the best, the strongest gardenia scent, but that's what I have. If you guys know of a really good gardenia, let me know down in the, the comment section. Then I have my sandalwood scents. This is uh, Sandal Ruby by Carolina Herrera's Confidential line. This is Scandalwood by Heretic Puffa. This is a natural brand, all natural, absolutely gorgeous sandalwood scent. This is a stronger sandalwood scent. So with sandalwood scents, I know there are really nice sandalwood body creams out there. I just haven't gotten 
a hold of a good one let me know down in the comment section if you know a really good sandalwood body cream this one right here the body scrub you guys this is by something called spa salon uh, this is a 100 percent natural sandalwood body scrub and this is red sandalwood by the way did you guys know about red sandalwood it's like so good for your health there's the sandalwood sandalwood and then there's red sandalwood this is the only one i have left i also had the sandalwood the, the, the white one uh, too but they you know i ran out of all of it i cannot find a sandalwood body scrub anywhere you guys this is the best sandalwood body scrub i've ever found it's amazing it's 100 percent natural but it's from Sri Lanka. you can't get a hold of it unfortunately here then I have, of course, the body products that came with the fragrance, which is not came with it. The body products from the same fragrance house that they released the matching body care, which is the ideal situation because you're not definitely not interfering with the scent then, you know what I mean? So then I have this one right here. This is so good. This is the Jo Malone Myrrh and Tonka body cream, you guys, to go with the Myrrh and Tonka fragrance this body cream is so good by the way this is a little liquidy so if you tip it over it'll fall down it's very kind of liquidy but it smells exactly exactly like Morantanka. then of course i have my parfum stem harley delina fragrances the original delina the delina exclusive and delina la rose and the fragrance house of course released a shower gel for delina and then there's the Delena body cream that smells exactly like the Delena fragrance. These both smell exactly like the Delena fragrance. So then I have this Narciso by Narciso fragrance and then the Narciso matching body lotion here that I like to wear together. Then I have this right here, the Gris Dior body wash to go with the Gris Dior uh, fragrance, the uh, Christian Dior Gris Dior fragrance. I also want to get the matching body cream. I haven't gotten it yet. I, I do need to get the matching body cream. Of course, I just talked about this. Um, the Jasma the Ange by, again, Dior Privé line. And then the matching body wash and the body cream. And then I have Lovey Abel and the Lovey Abel body cream. I wear this with all my Lovey Abel and flankers. Um, then I have my Chanel Paris Paris and the matching peri peri body cream that go of course well together this is that beautiful rose and patchouli scent this is a compliment getter people can smell it it smells super classy super sophisticated okay, then i have these gorgeous beauties here this is ananda by emikalaf and i have the ananda body wash right here the gel body wash and the body lotion body cream here they are match made in heaven. I really love it. It smells so good, you guys. When I shower with that body wash and I come out of the shower, I smell like a fresh goddess that dropped from heaven. And then, of course, this is like a goddess that dropped from heaven. Okay, so then I have this body cream, the Fenty Butter Drop, the original. This one, you guys, doesn't have a very strong scent. So I actually like to layer this with any fragrance that I don't have a body cream for unless I want to, you know, layer it with like jojoba oil or something like that, a fragrance-free body oil. This is kind of like a fragrance-free body cream. It has a very faint scent, but you can't even detect it. So that's it, you guys. That's basically almost my entire body care products that I like to layer with my prominent fragrances that I enjoy wearing all the time. So that's almost my entire body care line collection not all of it i have still some more upstairs but they're more like you know not the more prominent ones so let me know down in the comment section what do you think of my body care collection what do you think of these layering combinations before i go please don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you haven't done so already ring the notification bell so you will never miss any of my videos and don't forget to follow me on instagram and tiktok where i post a lot of fun content I will see you guys in my next video.